Claudine Lundula from uh, Congo, the DRC. I've been struggling with uh, a liver issue named uh, drug-induced liver injury since last November in uh, 2023. And I, I had to visit many countries to, to, have, uh, to have healthcare until I get to connect with uh, Dr. Shalendra Lalani through our, um, our translator uh, named uh, Nu, who helped us to get to connect with him uh, here at Manipal. And uh, after many exams, I, the doctor discovered that we had to go through liver transplant. It was a hard decision, but we had to do it. And uh, I would like to thank Dr. Lalwani and all his team, the ICU team, they really, they did a very good work. We had to be admitted for 18 days, but at the 13th day, it was, I, I could be discharged. And now I am doing well, one month and a half ago. I am doing really much better. And uh, this week we are going to go back in our country and the problem is really solved. So thank you so much and uh, God bless you. So uh, I want just to add something. I'm uh, Andre, the Claudine's husband. We come here at uh, Manipal with uh, so many questions. When uh, the doctor said that the best thing to do to her uh, was uh, the liver transplant. So we just, uh, struggling many things because the person who were prepared as a donor had a big issue with uh, his uh, his uh, passport then i decided to do it myself to become a donor so they evaluated me the big issue was that i was also uh, diabetics it was really a hard decision to take but uh, they evaluated me and uh, my diabetes was uh, very good controlled. Then, uh, so I, I was the donor and after this, I did just a six, six, uh, six days of admission, then I was uh, discharged. One thing I love here is uh, the way Dr. Lamwani take time to listen from the patient. I visited many hospitals here in India and that's very a particularity that I found in him. That's why I say thank you for all the work and uh, all the team and especially for Nuno who brought us here. Thank you. So patient Nashokano was from Congo. She was suffering from jaundice since last almost six months. She had malaria in her own country and then she took some treatment after that she started having jaundice. She was evaluated in Congo only but no cause was found so they, they did the cholecystectomy but jaundice didn't settle. So then she came to India six months back, she was evaluated in some other hospital but again no cause was found so they sent her back to Congo and managed her conservatively but jaundice was not reducing since last six months. Then she consulted us on video call and she came to India, she came to Manipal hospital. We evaluated her, we did the almost all tests to see the cause of jaundice, but again no cause was found. And uh, after doing all the investigation, we discussed with the family about the option of liver transplant. The family agreed on that after a few more consultations. And then uh, she underwent transplant, her recovery was very good. Immediately after transplant, jaundice was uh, settling and uh, she was discharged on 13th post-operative day and in the follow-up almost now one month is gone so now she is doing very well after liver transplant and now she is going to going back to Congo.